Okay, so playing major scales that start on a black note are a little bit of a different ball game. As you might recall with our white note does, we can actually pretty much use the same fingering the entire time. We had our one, two, three, cross under, one, two, three, four, five. Well, once you start using the black notes, just because of the nature of how your hand is shaped, you're gonna not necessarily start on your thumb. In fact, <laughs> you really don't, except for F. So um, just to kind of review where we were at before, let's start on F. We're gonna go one flat at a time. So in one flat, uh, in the key signature, Do is F. And we start on our thumb, yes, but we don't do one, two, three, cross under, because we have to cross under all the way up to this B flat, and it just doesn't feel good that way. So we often group our, our finger groups based on the black notes. So here's your first group going up to finger four there, and then you would cross over and do another group of four. Okay, so all together in a row all the way up and down, you'd have one, two, three, four, cross under to C, one, two, three, four, and you end on finger four instead of on the pinky. And on the way back down, you do the same, four, three, two, one, cross over with four to that B flat, four, three, two, so give that a try on your own if you'd like. The next one is B flat. In the key of B flat, we have two flats. It'll be these two right here, B flat and E flat. So our groups are gonna be, let's put aside the B flat for now. Our groups are gonna be here, a group of three, like this, and a group of four, like this. Okay, so we're actually gonna start on finger four, which seems odd, except that you think about when you're back at, at, in, in F major, how you crossed under to go from finger four on B flat to thumb on C. It's the same cross under. It's a lot more natural to the hand than, um, than other options. So you're gonna start on finger four, cross under to your thumb. Now you're gonna have your group of three, right? And then you're gonna cross under to your thumb again to F and you have your group of four. Okay, so all together it would do this, finger four, cross under, one, two, three, cross under, one, two, three, four. Okay, and the same thing on the way down, four, three, two, one, cross over with finger three, three, two, one, and end with a cross over to finger four. Okay, this is really handy if you're doing more than one octave as well. You might be starting up here, Ending on finger four gives the option to keep going. Okay, so that's where this fingering comes from. Okay, so here's the next one. With three flats, E flat would be do. And you would need flats for um, E flat, A flat, and B flat. Those are your black notes. Okay, and you're going to start on finger three this time. Okay, so you're gonna start on finger three, and again, we start with one of the cross unders. So three to finger one. Now you're gonna have a group of four here. Okay, two white notes, two black notes. So start on finger three, cross under, group of four, cross under again, group of three. You end with that group of three. So you're, this is your first group, your group of four, then your group of three. That's kind of how the fingers land. So start on the finger three and we'll walk all the way through it. We have three, cross under, one, two, three, four, cross under, one, two, three. And on the way down, three, two, one, cross over with four, four, three, two, one over with three. Okay, and on to four flats. If you're starting on A flat, your flats keys are here. So it's gonna look just a little bit different. You're gonna start on finger three again. Okay, so you're gonna have three, four. That's kind of your first little grouping. Cross under, and then you use these three. And then you cross under again, and use these three. Okay, so we're gonna walk all the way through it like we did before. We have three, four, Cross under, one, two, three. Cross under, one, two, three. I'm sorry, my hand position's a little funky. I'm dancing around the tripod here. It's right in my way, okay? So same thing again. We start on the bottom, three, four. Cross under, one, two, three. Cross under, one, two, three. And on the way back down, three, two, one. Cross over with three, three, two, one. Cross over with four. Okay, so last one is gonna be D flat. I'm gonna start down here so I don't get in my tripod's way. Okay, but essentially you're gonna be using the same fingering that you did on the very first week when you were finding the groups of two and three black notes. You're gonna have your finger two and three on this group, finger two, one, two, and three, or sorry, two, three, and four 
on this group. Okay, you're just gonna make sure your thumb plays the white notes in between. So start on finger two, two, three. You're gonna cross under with your thumb to that F. And then you have two, three, four. Cross under with your thumb. One, two. So you end with finger two. Okay, let's try that again where I walk you through it. We've got two, three, cross under to one. Two, three, four, cross under to one. And end on two. On the way down, two, one, cross over with four. Four, three, two, one, cross over with three, two. Okay, so that's how you play all of your major scales.